somebody made a nice little observation. So if you guys remember, when we went from radians to degrees, right? Go from radians to degrees, we multiplied by 180 over pi. When we went from degrees to radians, we multiplied by pi over 180, right? Oh, yeah, so to go from degree to DMS, we multiplied each decimal by 60. So if we're going to go to DMS to degree, you can think we'd be using division. division. And that's exactly what we're doing. In reality, how many degrees is this total? 13. These are all portions of a degree. Well, eight minutes. How many possible minutes are there in one degree? 60. So it's 8 divided by 60 minutes. Uh, 8 divided by 60 minutes. And then how many, how many seconds are there in one degree? Well, let's think about it. How many seconds are in there in a minute? 60. And there's 60 minutes in a degree. So 60 times 60 is 3,600. So now, all you guys are going to do to find, figure this one out is now you're dividing by 60 and you're dividing by 3,600. So 8 divided by 60 is 1.33. And then you're going to add that to 20 divided by 3,600, which is 1.38. I'm going to round. This is 0 0.005. And those are extending. When I add these all up and, uh, and round, I get point, I'm sorry, I get 13.139 as I'm going to approximate. So I'm going to round 113.139. Because it will approximate to the thousandths in this case. Okay?